What's going on, YouTube gang? It's your boy FYB Mark coming back at you with another video. And today we're gonna be speaking on the situation on this Texas man, bro. Because at the end of the day, bro, right is right and wrong is wrong, bro. And yes, I'ma be honest. Was the was his wife all the way right, bro? No, she was not all the way right, bro. Cause according to you know the whole situation. Yeah, she didn't cheat on the man, yada, yada, yada. And the man felt like he was getting cheated on. Okay. But at the end of the day, bro, I'm going to be honest. And this goes within any situation, within a relationship, bro, within certain shit, bro. I'm going to be honest. Motherfucker ain't putting no, no knife, no gun up to your neck, bro. Nobody deserves the fucking, bro. <laughs> Nobody deserves that shit, bro. Nobody deserves to get almost die over some, some bullshit, bro, that you can walk away from straight up. Do your homework on walking away from the situation, bro. That's all this man had to do, bro. I know he was hurt at the time, bro, and I know he felt some type of way, bro, about his wife cheating on him and shit. But at the end of the day, bro, instead of you out here over whooping like you did, bro, costing you... Because, don't get me wrong, he ain't get sentenced for shit, bro. You got 10 years, bro. So, that, that shit ain't nothing for what you did, bro. But at the end of the day, you just threw your life away. For what, bro? When you could have just walked your ass away, bro, and found something new. Do your homework on how many fucking fish is out here in this damn ocean, bro. There's plenty of fish out here in this ocean, bro. Yeah, she done cheated on you and broke your heart. And y'all got kids, bro. You got to be mindful about your kids, bro. Walk the fuck away from the situation. Straight up. Now your daughter got to deal with the fact that her dad locked up for shooting her mom and all this other... Like, come on, bro. Motherfucker don't even realize, but do you understand you just traumatized your daughter, bro, by doing some shit like that? No matter if she seen it or not, bro. Just the fact of being around some shit like that, bro. You're a product of your environment, bro. So when you around that type of environment, that shit fucks with your mind, your mental, all that shit, bro. This shit fucked up, bro. We got to do better, bro. This man definitely fucking overwhooped, bro. You could have walked your ass up the fuck away from the situation. You could have still been a fucking free man right now. No, you want to sit up here and pull out a gun on your fucking, your wife that was cheating on you, bro. Lead the bitch. Lead the bitch. Go find somebody else. I'm pretty sure that you had a, a co-worker or something that liked you. Go go be with the co-worker that you, you, you think like you or something. Like, what the fuck? You out here over whooping, shooting bitches and trying to shoot bitches and threaten bitches with guns. That shit ain't cool, bro. You overwhooping, overwhooping, and that's where your ass is, where the fuck your ass is, bro, straight up, this situation, crazy in the motherfucker, and we just gotta pray for this baby, bro, because at the end of the day, I already know she a little traumatized, because look at what just happened with your parents, bro, straight up, straight up, bro, and like I said, bro, kids, y'all gotta understand, parents, y'all gotta understand, bro, these kids is products of their environment, bro. So when they see fucked up shit, when they around fucked up shit, guess what's going to happen later on in life? Something similar to the fucked up shit that they seen in life. It hit different. But it's your boy, F.R. Mar, man. I'm just giving you my thoughts on this situation. Y'all like, comment, subscribe, G. And I'm out.